Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps Cooking. Please click on the bell icon, you will get all the notification of my new videos and let's get started. Hello everyone, please welcome to Easy Steps Cooking. Today I'm going to share with you very quick and easy recipe. Basically it's a food hack. We all love Alu Methi Di Purji. It's so delicious, it's super tasty. And Methi, we call it in English, fenugreek leaves. Fenugreek leaves with potatoes. It's so delicious that you will love it. You go to store and get the fresh methi. But what if you don't have a fresh methi available? Then I'm going to share with you how to make it quick and easy alu methi di sabji. So basically it's a food hack. And I have tried it many times. My lady, my kids, they love it. This is the kasuri methi. This is the dry kasuri methi, fenugreek leaf. And I will share with you how to make it delicious recipe, alu methi di purji. Please try it and you're going to like it. And trust me, you're going to say, wow, it's the same taste as the fresh methi. And without wasting any time, let's get started. The ingredients we need, alu, which is potato, four potatoes, fenugreek leaves, it's a dry suri methi, one cup. Cumin seed, jeera, two teaspoon, ginger, two teaspoon. All of the spices will be one teaspoon each. Turmeric powder, salt, grinder powder, black pepper, garam masala. Red chili flake, that's strictly optional. And if you want to use the green chili, you can add that also. Small onion, one, and olive oil for our tarka. Get a peeler and we're going to peel the potatoes. Once it's peeled, cut the potatoes. This is the perfect thickness. Cut it like this, small chunks. Not too big, not too small. If you look at this, this is the perfect size. Cold water ready in a pot and it's strainer. And we're going to put it inside. It will be get washed and also it won't get discolored. So I'm going to finish up cutting all the potatoes. Potatoes are cut into small chunks and it's washed. Drain it and we are ready to make our alu methi di purji. Get a fry pan, start the gas, bring olive oil and you can use any vegetable oil. As the oil start to heat up, bring cumin seed, jeera. We're going to cook onion for like a two minutes. We're just going to keep the onion fresh and bring the ginger as well. So mix it well. Cooking for one minute, this is how it looks. They are looking fresh. This is what we need. I'll bring the spices, and then we're going to cook the spices along with onion for one minute, salt together two minutes. Salt, grinder powder, black pepper, garam masala, red chili flake, and turmeric powder. Mix it well. So we're going to cook half minute. So once all the spices are nicely incorporated with onion, so all together cooking our onion for two minutes. Now I'm going to bring the gas to medium. I'll add the potatoes. Mix it well. On medium gas. Once it's nicely incorporated, spread it evenly. Cover with the lid and we're going to cook it for five minutes. Cooking for five minutes on medium gas with the cover layer. Mix it well. 
This is another recipe potatoes, alu. I have posted on my channel. Please check it out. You can eat as is. This is very delicious recipe. You need to just cook the alu more until they get tender. Once it's nicely combined, I'm going to bring kasuri methi. Mix it well. Once it's nicely combined, cover with the lid and we're going to bring our gas to medium low, which is number two. And cook it for 10 minutes. After five minutes, open it and mix it so that it won't get burned. Cooking on the medium low gas for exactly 10 minutes. Mix it. Once it's nicely combined, look at this. Alu methi di purti. And if I check uh, the potatoes, it's nicely cooked. And we're going to turn up the gas. I have my serving fry ready. And we're going to dish out. This is the perfect recipe with paratha or puris. Let me share with you. Our quick and easy alu methi di purji is all ready. Please try it and you're going to like it. Serve with hot roti, chapati, fulka, naan, paratha, even puris and everyone going to like it. If you try it and you like it, share and subscribe Easy Steps Cooking. Thank you and have a good day. Bye-bye.